Right, let's take this Jaguar XJ 4.2 Sovereign long wheelbase for a spin. All the warning lights come on and everything uh, goes out the way it should. That's it. Perfect. Nice stereo. I'll turn that down a bit so we can hear what's going on. And off we go. Pulls away really beautifully. I can't actually fault the way it drives. Uh, it has apparently, I haven't been through the history yet, but apparently it had a new gearbox about 2,000 miles ago. And we've got climate control, which is all uh, up together. And certainly driving-wise, say no rattles, clunks, bangs, any nonsense like that. Um, it tracks nice and straight, as you can see. No problems there at all. I've had it up to about sort of 50, 60 miles an hour and it performs uh, superbly. <coughs> so these do tend to drive beautifully uh, if they're a nicely maintained example. And this one uh, certainly seems to be the case from that point of view. Being a Sovereign, it's got all sorts of extra bits and bobs on it compared to a standard one. Um, obviously, it's a long wheelbase version as well and it has got uh, electric uh, adjustment from the Rear, from the rear passenger seats that you can make the, uh, the, the front seat here move so it give you a bit of extra leg room and things. Uh, but it's got all the burr, burr walnut, it's got electric seats for the driver and front passenger. Um, we've got uh, the switchable automatic gearbox, we've also got cruise control. We've got uh, traction control on these ones. We've got the digital climate control which is uh, fully working and nice and cold. Uh, big stereo with the CD in the boot. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, electric windows all round, electric mirrors. Uh, the driver's seat has memory function on it as well. Um, the stereo is the high powered version. And we've got things like electric uh, steering column adjustment as well. As I say, these 4-litre um, sovereigns do tend to have uh, pretty much everything on them. It uh, doesn't get hot, I've done about 25 miles on it now, and the temperature gauge sits exactly on the halfway point. As always, need some fuel in it. So, nice to drive really, it's... Uh, can't detect any uh, problems or issues with it at all. We're up to about 50 miles, 50 miles an hour now. It's as quiet as they come. Possibly very slight bottom ball joint on the off side. I can just feel a very slight uh, little bit of kickback through the steering wheel over bumps. So it's possible it needs a bottom ball joint on it. For its next MOT. As always, these ride beautifully. Um, ride is probably even better being the long wheelbase version, in fairness. Okay, we're coming up to where we turn off. Okay, my name's Simon. If you have any further queries or questions, you can ring me on 0771 906 9353 or in the office on 0118 946 3352. End.